Shalom, Yah Shalom, Shalom. First and foremost, I want to give all praise, honor, and glory to the Most High Yahweh. I do so in the name of His only begotten Son, Yahweh Shai. Double honors to the apostles and the elders of Yasharala. Kol Haloyim La, Yahweh Ba Hashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba Hashem Harakakudash. Blessing our elders with the spirit of truth so that we may know. Shout out to the Akim and the Akwaf that's keeping the faith in the work. Shall keep at it. It's your brother Abaya coming at you with more precepts. Um, uh, scripture says that the Most High is a jealous power, right? Um, the Messiah told us that it's basically two great commandments that we got to keep, and in those two embodies the whole law. And the first one is, um, if I'm not mistaken, love the Most High with all your heart, mind, soul, and strength. And the second is, love your neighbor as you love yourself, right? So with that being said, we got to make sure that we uh, put the Most High first in everything that we do, right? Make sure that you give the most high time, man, right? That's why scripture tells us to study to show ourselves approved, blessed is he that reader, um, seeking ye shall find, knocking the door shall be um, open unto you, right? Asking it shall be given you, but only way you can get those things is if you've been dealing with the most high. So make sure that you're dealing with the most high to the best of your ability, man. I'm, I'm not saying that you keep your keep your head in the Bible, you know, 24/7. But what I am saying is, make time for the Lord, right? If you want the Lord to make time for you, make time for the Lord. Scripture says, "I love those that love me." So make sure you make time for the Lord, right? Abba know, so Abba Yahweh knows. Um, well, Abba Yahweh by Shimei Abba Shai. They know that um, you know what we go through in our day to day. Right, we we in the curses. They know we gotta uh, go to our enemies and want all things. They know we got uh, trials and tribulations because all of that is a part of being in the situation that we're in. But what is uh, what shows us in a positive light to the Father is seeking Him in the midst of all of this, relying on Him to get us out of situations, relying on Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, seeking the Lord. Right. Make time for the Lord, man. First thing when you wake up, man, have the Lord on your mind. Give praise. You know, call the Lord. Like you have Hashem, you have Shai. Hashem, you have It's simple, right? It's simple. That one, that one sentence, that one phrase, man. Call, call the Lord. You have a Hashem, you have a Shai. Hashem, you have First thing in the morning. Same thing at night, right? And throughout the day, you constantly uh, keeping your your mind on the Lord, right? Scripture tells us to meditate on these things, man. So that means, like, hey, you set your mind all right, right? Make time for the Lord. Make time for the Lord. Make time for the Lord, especially in, in these times to come, right? It, 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 with each breaking story, with each story that comes out in the news, it just coincides more and more with, with prophecy in a more effective way, right? Meaning it gets harder and harder and closer and closer and worse and worse, you know? So... Make sure that you are making time for the Lord, right? So that the Lord can make time for you, especially in, in, in when you really need him, you know? When you really need the Lord. So we don't want to be the individuals that's calling calling on the Lord uh, uh, in, our, in our time of trouble and we're not getting no response. So make time for the Lord. Right, now that's all I wanted to say, man. That's all the spirit, you know, um, led me to say. All right, so and with that, hey, how about Shemal Shah Rats's all these precepts in this video, or well, these quoted precepts in this video were edifying. Call Haloyim Lah, Yahweh Ba Hashem Yahweh Shai, Ba Hashem Harakatadash, Shalom Yashalom.